so I just uh, used this uh, MAC address generator to generate a MAC address. <laughs> Uh, they exist, so that's uh, that's good to know. Um, I'm also uh, uploading the second video, which will be available in a couple of seconds, um, with the stuff I've just done. So let's get back to the other side. And um, okay, I need a manual. I just wrote down the MAC address here and some uh, services that should be available. Uh, so what I want to do now, because this hardware address actually is some kind of uh, generic broadcast address, if you use that for as MAC address. So I could think that my router doesn't like this um, MAC address. So let's change the hardware address to the one I just generated. Um, I have no idea if that this will work. Um, I think entering the address will work, but I've now they have uh, actually the... Oh, okay. Delete, delete, delete. Oh no, come on. FE... Um, I don't know if the Spectronet will actually get a IP address if I try this. Um, could be several reasons that it is not working. It could be my router that uh, doesn't like uh, this equipment. I don't know. I have no idea. I've never tested it, you guys. Hey, why this? Ugh. Why doesn't this work? One, two, three, four. I guess I just have to enter the letters then. So without, <laughs> because I don't don't have any. Mm -hmm. Okay, I I just need to enter the. The numbers and the letters. So uh, six B F E F E. Sorry, F E six B F E three F zero uh, D and six one. Oh, okay, that was the wrong button. Dang it! Um, I, I should have pressed um, G. Hardware address. I thought I was entering the hardware address, so strange. So I guess I should. <laughs> okay, everyone can make a mistake, you know. Six uh, B. Ah, oh, come on. Why is the keyboard not working? Six uh, B. Only have one hand available. Six uh, B F E. Three F. Zero D. And six one. Yeah, this does work. And then, uh, right, we have another. MAC address now, and I want to change my hostname back because I liked White Light. Right, so we're set again. Now we have to press I for, to save the changes. It says it's saving the configuration. I don't know where, but it, it will. And let's see what happens when we reboot. First thing, whoa, something changed. Yeah, we got an IP address, look at that, woohoo! 1.15 in my home net, well, that's great. Oh, okay, that's cool. Uh, well, what can we do now? I want to connect to something. Um, configuring the file system, you'll need a file server, this is a public file server, we can, oh, there, this this one, okay, this is uh, the same one I just wrote down here, so that's good. To mount a file system, use the mount command, for example. That's exactly the one that I just got from someone. Uh, so let's try it out. Percentage sign mount. I never did have done this before, so this is actually really my first time. Oh, sorry, zero comma, and then quotes. Said four dot uh, dot net. Okay, we're getting there. This is so cool. My spectrum is actually now connected to to internet. And what would happen if we do this? Nothing. <laughs> it's quite likely you want to do so. When it, the menu will appear. It does, no menu appears. What can I do now? I mounted something, but I don't know. <laughs> Navigating a file system. Okay. Um, a brief guide. But I, um, okay, we did mount something. And then... Examples URL would just work. Okay, and mount cat. Okay, we can cat something. So I guess we're looking into a file system from someone then. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow, wow. I just, uh, I'm going to clear the, the screen first. So we're actually looking at a server on the internet from someone. Look here, look here. We can actually see 
what's inside one of the servers. There are demos, there are games here. Wow, cool. No, what we can we do now? Can we go into... Yeah, we can use the, com the change directory command. Wow, this is great. Look at that. Let's try it. Let's try it. Um, and I'm afraid if I'm going to publish this video that everyone is wanting a Spectronet, uh, which will make me uh, have less sleep even. Right, this, this works. Uh, let's do a cat again. Oh, look at that. Uh, what shall we do? Classic, new, I like new. Okay, change directory. New. This is so cool. Okay, cat. It's, it's quite hard doing this by one hand. Look at that, all the games. Alright, I have no idea which games these are. Factory.sna. I want to load Factory.sna. Why? Because I just w was watching some videos uh, about a new game for PC, of course, uh, which is called uh, Satisfactory. So I'm into factories now. Uh, how do I load this? There's a load command here. Oh, that, it's so simple, man. This is simpler than I thought. Wow. Nope. A uh, load. Oh, I don't need a comma. Load. This is so cool. Um, Factory, I hope it works. If this will work, oh well, it would be so great. And loading a snapshot, should I do anything special for that? You guys just want me to press enter, I guess. Tape in load snap, oh. I, uh, there's a load snap command, so I don't think this will work. Incorrect header length, you see? So I, I think I should use the load snap command for this. Load snap. Isn't this cool? Um, I should do this live, but I, I'm uploading it immediately after making the video. Um, factory dot s n a quote. Wow, it's doing something. It's loading. It's loading. It's loading. It's loading. What is it doing? Oh, look at that! Wow, I just loaded a game from the internet on the Zenix Spectrum. How cool is that? <laughs> wow, this is awesome. I've never seen this game. <laughs> and there's no music. Dang it. I should have some music here. Can I just... Can I Can I please plug in this? Oh, I hope I'm not ruining anything here. Ah, we got sound. Wow. Oh man, this is so cool. I just loaded my first game from the internet. On the ZX Spectrum. How awesome is that? I really need to upload this because everyone wants to see this, isn't it right? Wow, how cool is this? Wow! It's so cool man, it's just so cool! I can't, I can't stop talking about it. Anyway, I should really upload this video. This is the coolest ever. Bye bye!